over Sylvia Bowles. Sylvia. Hi, Syl. Do you have us? Congratulations on this win. Thank you. A huge win for you tonight. What did it feel like on the court to see this team withstand that third quarter from Indiana? What were you seeing? Um, just a lot of talking, a lot of momentum, trying to get ourselves back into it. Um, I felt like we was a little flat, so the more we talked to each other, the better it was for us just to get back in the groove. Sylvia, we love watching the battle when there's another big on the court like McCowan's, and we love what it brings out in you, always the best. But what what is it like going up against her? And she did cause some issues in there tonight. Uh -huh. uh, she's a big body man all around, so you really have to play on both ends of the floor, but you also want to make her work on the, both ends of the floor. So I think um, I had an advantage tonight. Uh, she made her breaks, and she got me on some good ones, but I would stand it throughout the game, and we came out with the win. Still, um, Coach Reeve talked about before the game that sometimes when you're expected to win, it can take the joy out of it, like USA yeah. Basketball, for example. Yeah. Is that something you try and put a focus on in the locker room, like celebrating what you've done against another WNBA team? Yes, uh, uh, Cheryl brings this, uh, this up all the time, just making sure we celebrate the little moments um, and making sure everybody is involved, uh, not taking the credit for everything, but making sure everybody understands their role, but just going out there and play with a, a lot of fun on our shoulders. Still, it's talked about probably too much, but winning three in a row against the same team. Ooh. Everyone says that it's difficult. It's what, difficult. What is the mindset going in, going up against Indiana, this time on their home court? Um, Indiana brought it tonight here, so we got to expect changes because it was a big change from game one to game two, and I'm sure it's going to be more changes from game two to game three. So we got to make sure we bring our A game and not take Indiana for granted because, as you can see, they're a team that stays around, and they work hard as well. All right, Sylvia Fowles, thank you so much for joining us. Congrats thank you. again. Thank you. Thanks, Sil. Sylvia Fowles, just magnificent to watch. She and the Minnesota Lynx take the victory tonight, 90-80. to 80.